Hello and welcome back to Shadow Billcraft. After more than one year or something like that, I'm back. So I'm back for a short stream to pick it up where we last left. Oh, it's night time, so I should go to bed. And to tell you, yes, I'm back to streaming. I hope to be doing start to be doing this regularly. Also, this is going to YouTube, and yeah, I guess this is gonna be like a short. Uh, one hour stream because it's late at night, but I wanted to test that I'm back in the game and trying to get a better stream quality uh, You know stuff like that So let's let's do a short update on what, I, what I've been doing so in one year There's a lot has been going on in version 1.10 regarding uh, mods so what I've been able to do is to add something of about 80 mods so this is this has become uh, a neutral mod survival instead of a slightly mod survival as you can see i have a lot of stuff uh, i have applied energistics which amazingly made it back to version 1.10 and 1.12 now i have a uh, an alpha version of Carpenter's Blocks. I should check back because I think I'm sure he, he made some more progress. So maybe they are in beta right now. I have Blood Magic. I have Ars Magica, as you can see for my 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 little hat here. You know you know the hat R right below here. The the red and and light blue markers. And so I've been doing some mining and. This is gonna be amazing. Uh, I think this is gonna make it a little bit more entertaining because you know I can do you know storage. Uh, I can do the storage better. I have thermal expansion, which is amazing. I think I didn't have it before. I have Ender IO. I have uh, base metals with some some metal doors and stuff. What else do I have? Some missing textures. Yeah, nice. Malice stores. Uh, wait a minute. Open computers? No. I didn't get that. Uh, I have uh, compact machines, which should be pretty amazing. So, yeah, that, that makes it a different game. And so, what I was trying to, to find out here is that I, I did some mining. I mined this, this little hole because I, I, I wanted to find out if if the metals and, and ores, if I was able to like like do this, uh, uh, like uh, find you know the new metals if I mine a little bit farther away. Turns out that I had been doing a lot of exploration before, and so there were a lot of chunks, uh, you know, already loaded, uh, and so for that reason. Uh, what I had to do, I had to go to MC Edit and delete all of, all of the chunks from from the wall, and have them regenerated. Uh, that is good news and bad news. Good news is I have new stuff to mine right there, right here, you know, besides my base. There's some lava here. So, for example, I have some lead that I'm going to start mining right now. Silver is also useful for the chests. Have silver. I have like a yeah. I don't know how it's called it. The expanded chests. So let's do some mining to just to explore what do we have here. I want to. I need to, to start going with applied energistics as soon as possible. I have yellow right because I brought uh, and this is coming right for for Ars Magica which I don't need right now. So I brought back, this was already ongoing, this is a port of, of uh, big reactors, it's called Extreme Reactors. Uh, I hadn't, uh, I, I think I didn't have this in, in the previous version of uh, of Shadow Billcraft because it wasn't really necessary. The energetic, the energy side of the, of the mod pack wasn't really useful because I didn't have any machines to, to you know, to take advantage of, of the energy, so so that was the reason why I wasn't uh, adding these these mods. Like there was already a port of, of applied energistics that I, I was ignoring and extreme reactors as well. But now that I have all this, 
you know, I can actually take advantage. The bad news is that I had to regenerate every single chunk that I had. And so I lost a really, really beautiful mountain range uh, in which I was planning some building. Uh, I, I, my idea was to try to acquire some wings uh, early in the game or, or as early as possible or even go to creative and then build some kind of a fantasy, you know, uh, middle age building in the mountains. And I had a perfect uh, landscape for that, but that is all gone. I mean, I went to the mountains, they are like almost cut off. The regeneration was really bad, so we don't have that. So we're gonna have to improvise and see, you know, where, where should we go from there? Uh, but good thing this is going to become like really I think I think this is gonna be more interesting. We're gonna keep the building perspective of the stream, but we have a lot more to to work on. You know, also uh, like things like Arma Ars Magica and and even apl applied energistics, they bring some new textures to the game. Which are really entertaining. Oh what's this? I think this is gonna hurt me. It doesn't. What is this thing? So I I already explored this before. Before the chunks, I think this is blood or something. This is or liquid. I think that's liquid redstone because oh I I also I have a lot of the project red. So if you load if if I get project. Uh, project wait project red. So I have project, project Red Exploration, uh, I have Ruby, Peridot, stuff like that, which is really, really useful. The, the color light, lightings, the cables, redstone cables, and I wanted to see if I had liquid redstone, but it, think, it seems I don't have. So some of you might be wondering why I haven't been streaming for over a year, and the reason is that I was like, really really um, busy with stuff things happening uh, I was traveling a lot and then you know I had some family issues I had to stop for for a while collect myself uh, then some really nice things happened like I got married uh, like a few days ago I had a crazy party and then I traveled again, some kind of like a honeymoon, which was amazing. So that that happened as well, which is really good. And now I'm like a little bit more organized with my time, and you know I can I can go back to to my my little projects. Uh, you know, as in before, I had to be like you know worried about my responsibilities at work and stuff like that. And, didn't have time for for much else so wow where do I put this already this is approaching full let's see I don't remember how do I build myself a nice door for for here this is these are curtains so I don't I don't like factory door this could be done laboratory door is probably looks better jail is that is not a jail Iron glass, saloon door, <laughs> that's interesting. Carish, medieval door, ah, that's, wow, medieval door. But, oh, this, oh, look at that, reinforce. I wonder, what is this for? How could this be? What is this used for? Is it just a regular door or needs to be probably needs to be like activated? I'm not sure I want that for my very simple you know thing. High tech door. Wow, a lot of new stuff. I'm gonna go with the laboratory door for now. I do have some gold. Yeah, remember I think there was no no brass here so yeah a 
laboratory door is gonna be okay. Yeah. Oh. Shoot. Okay. I can fix that. That that is not place for a torch. Okay, let's put my doors here and have some of this. I have a chisel here. What can I get up there that is gonna look nice and it's not gonna be a window? Probably this. Oh crap. Okay, that's not so bad. <laughs> Let's leave it. Okay, we are going to get this cover. And yeah, that's gonna be okay. Uh, regarding the glass. You know, I'm gonna take care of the, the, the glass here because I want this to be a seal thing. I want this to be safe, let's say, and the purple, I really like the purple. Magenta. Purple could go with that. Oh, I already had marble and limestone before. Okay, so let's see about the let's let's make some some glass. Okay, here. Make some glass here and uh, let's let's try some dyeing. Yeah, that's fine. I think I don't need much more than 16 paints. Let's see. One, two, three. Yeah, that doesn't look so bad. Perfect. Nice, so that's, yeah, awesome. Very little glass. And now I need to, to see how I'm going to take care of the lighting here. I, I think for now, oh, I cannot chisel the torches anymore. That's terrible. But I think I have the candles. So I can make some candle. Oh, I have Pam's Harvest Craft, which that it's amazing. Uh, so yeah, this is a candle. I don't know what is, if it's useful, really useful for decoration. I have these lanterns from Bibliocraft. That's another really important mod that I added, Bibliocraft, of course. So that's really good for building. What I don't see is the... Uh, huh. Project Red Illumination. That's really cool. Extra Util Redstone Lantern. I also have Mine Factory Reloaded. Awesome. I have the plastic, I have... And I have the laser drill. I have the sunglasses oh. <laughs> what do they do left shift for detail infuse experience experience <laughs> that's interesting stain glass pain I think this is a different sort of glass that I might try Oh, that's just chisel, okay. Road. I can chisel road. That's pretty amazing. Oh, actually. Oh, this is uh, the actual block. I have white stone, sky stone, lapis bricks. Amazing. 
really really amazing I wanna I wonder what's that red stuff that looked like blood I'm gonna have to check that out grab it with a bucket and see see what what's 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 it all about so here should be my little thing and my little smeltery and up there I should start working on a ceiling which for that I need to grab some wood but first I want to get rid of the extra stuff that I have here glass oh I have some seal bricks oh that's awesome I don't even remember what I did in my last stream so I you know I don't know okay so this is this is pretty cool we're pretty advanced here we can we can go forward with with the smeltery that's great and on the woods department huh I have maple wood I thought that was something else uh, besides natura which it seems that I already had uh, I think I configured to have the great woods which is turned off by default so that's gonna be a good thing okay starting with the ceiling uh, project first I'm gonna make myself a couple of stacks of wood and okay four more some slabs this is gonna be okay for now and what I need get back to me also the glass probably gonna be useful for later yeah ah I have a lot of clay which is awesome as well um, so what I'm gonna need is a different sort of wood but maybe just regular stuff yeah for the accents also I'm gonna make myself some slabs because I have no idea what I'm gonna use so let's put the two slabs here and yeah and this Now let's go to work. Okay, so I need a way to climb because we cannot fly yet. And this makes things much, much slower, but yeah. So what I'm thinking is first, so this has to have a, some kind of an overhang as a roof, which makes it kind of tricky oh we have we have company there hi hello sir uh, you come to kick my ass or something wow he comes straight at me like I'm gonna punch you in the face hey sir you have a, a motion cape that's 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 pretty neat but I'm gonna have to kill you I'm sorry yep hey you just stand there Wow, he's still alive. Okay, that was that was really boring. Uh, okay, when you learn how to fight. So yes, we have now those those fellows uh, wandering around. I'm I don't really know how to turn them off in the configuration. But okay, so back to the ceiling uh, thing. So I have a one one white uh, center which is going to come in handy to start uh, thinking of a shape here uh, so I'm gonna do the the accent first I think and I'm going to try so this would be nice if I had some I have stairs but maybe I need to take care of the shape of the ceiling of, like a little bit later I mean I mean uh, the very details of the ceiling oh okay so the, yeah this is bound to happen I have no idea why I didn't take damage do I have any sort of special boots no I don't
and here here it happens that when when you cannot fly or you're not in creative it's so hard for you to like check out the shapes you know from far away and doing the stuff but I'm pretty sure I'm, I'm pretty sure I know what I want in terms of shape so this is this is pretty close this is pretty close to the center I I want stairs I think I need I need stairs so I'm gonna do like a stair shape uh, right right off from here which yeah I think it's gonna have to be like up here up here so up from this slab here no I don't reach and then so it's gonna go up the problem is that we're gonna have a smeltery down there and I don't know I don't know man that might not work in the long run because I want to have the the three by three chimney which is a huge thing okay so let, let me let, let's go on with this I'm gonna finish that ceiling and then if I have to modify it I modify it but so the stairs concept is it's gonna give me a I, and I think I need just four let's do another four just in case and st stack of oak wood Thank you. And for 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 an overhang, that's not really that's not very nice. Um, yeah. Uh, oh my, my axe is missing. maybe something like like that but I'm not sure how can I continue with with the all around shape and that's not not that's not really nice so what I what you need is just that just a you know hanging hanging roof so stair here oh wow yeah I took damage now you do take damage. Building stuff without wings or you know feather boots or stuff is really it's really hard. So after that what you need is the the inverted stair. I can't reach Okay. So let's get myself some some height. Invert the stair here because we need wow, and I'm out of stairs already. It's a good thing that I had a lot of wood with me. I shouldn't need more than this. Okay. Okay, so the structure here for the internal structure of the ceiling. Let's leave that to save time. And here, what you do is just a, a block because this is going to be creating this sort of curvature here. Uh, that might work actually. This might be the place where the sear bricks join. Yeah, no, actually, no. I, actually, it's going to collide with the with the structure, but that that's fine. That that's fine. Uh, guess what? I need more stairs. Why do I have three stairs? Because there's one here.
So okay, let's let's get more more of this because I need I need more stairs to ease out the shape of the roof. Twelve would be enough. I'm going to end here with a one block sort of uh, pointy edge to the ceiling and then I'm going to modify this you know once I build the, uh, the, the smeltery it's gonna be like tall enough then if the smeltery is, is gets to, to the ceiling then I can like modified it. I'm thinking this is too tall and this should be no oh, but that's okay. That's okay. I don't need such a steep ceiling. I can just get the stairs here and never be able to climb up again. And it's night time, that's gonna be horrible. I don't think this is uh, what I want actually. Okay, maybe this this works. The thing is ah oh, wow, I'm bound to get myself a hell of a bang all right uh yeah and here i need to come back no idea how i'm gonna do it but yeah basically i need to go back there and and you know and get the and get some fences oh i left everything open nice let's go back to bed hopefully nothing spawned and okay so what do i need i need fences which i don't remember how you do okay this is nice i need uh sorry i need more stairs Okay, so that's you know if you if you check it out from 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 away, it's too tall. So that's obviously not what you want. You want a, a, you know you want it to be gentler. I didn't want it to be so high. So I'm going to remove all this. Probably just a stair here. Yeah, that's fine. Oh, wow. Okay. That's bound to happen a lot. So, mm, yeah, that might, that might work. Okay, so this is maybe a better shape. So the problem with this with this shape is that it's not it, it doesn't you don't see a curve. I think I I can live with it because the problem is right between these two stairs that I'm pointed at. Hmm. But I don't think there's anything I can do, to be honest. And here I can raise this one up. Uh, 
I want because still this is going to be steeper than I want it and so this is gonna be more than enough and the fence oh no not that one and then Why, why can't I? I can't? Oh, yes I can, of course. So that should be, yeah, that's, that's, some, that's some kind of a better ceiling right there. It's a better shape. So shapes, shapes are hard. Uh, I'm gonna put some torches here just for the sake of not getting myself run by mobs okay yeah I, I, I figure that they're not perfectly placed but there's something okay so and then yeah maybe Wow. Okay. Oh, okay, I didn't want to do that, but that looks awesome. <laughs> okay, so that's that's the ceiling and that I mean that, that that's the accent of the ceiling with that o that the like, overhang over there and might as well just do the four of them because these these are tricky to do. <laughs> the one off overhang. And as you can see over there, those were the mountains that were like full of grass and trees and, and beautiful and now they're they, they look like cut off with lava flowing down from there, they're all stone. So something happened when uh, when the chunks were, you know, regenerated. That didn't end that well. Okay, awesome. Okay, I'm coming back up anyway for those slabs. Okay, so 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 this is the accentuation of the ceiling, and then we need to do something. Oh, okay. So we need to do something with the 3D aspect of it as well, because that's probably not going to look really well. So maybe this, you know. That might work. Yeah, that works. So let's let's do the the surroundings here. That works, and I think I don't need the the extra block overhanging. Uh, I don't know. You might you might comment on it if you want so the idea is that the accent the accentuation of the ceiling goes slightly uh, above the, the, the actual you know the, the ceiling body which is what I'm doing right now okay Cool, uh, and that probably works or probably doesn't. We, I, I will have to find out later. So, from here, I'm going to enter the roof. So I'm going to leave that. And so I was building this way, this way. 
So what I might do is I might just do a quarter of the ceiling after I finish with this round. Actually taking the opportunity to take the slabs, the oak slabs. Okay. No more, no more slabs. So I have to go back. Let's, let's make ourselves... Oh, I had two more here. But... You know... How many slabs do I need? I never know. How many slabs do you need for a slab ceiling? How can you know that? Okay, so this is the first. So I'm gonna work on this, this quarter ceiling here. So what I might do is get it to to half, half a slab down and since this is already two blocks uh, long and this and this is one up i might as well just continue here like this that's that looks okay so one extra And then this is either the stairs or the, the blocks. If I set blocks here, it's gonna give it like a like a different texture. Like, like it's going to to work against the 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 the, um, the easy shape that I build here is going to go against this shape that is going to be like more rough. That that also serves as, as an accentuation of some sort. And then I can coronate that with a small stair, but I think that might not be necessary. I need to go down and look at it from from up there. So you find yourself a mountain, and you see like like the ceiling looks looks quite okay. Uh, what you might add to it, if you can see it from here, what you might add to it now the accentuation is being lost a little bit. Uh, when it, when it gets to the same level as the as the dark oak color, so I'm going to get two slabs onto the stairs. You know, like extending the stair shape. That's gonna make it better. So two slabs on each side. I have 32. I'm gonna make myself another stack of slabs. Slabs. Okay, that should be enough. Okay, that, that kind of works. It's not the best ceiling I've done in my life, but I mean, that works. So what I was seeing from, from far away is this, this thing. So now the shape now the shape looks much better because we have two, we have three, two, two, and then it goes a little bit downwards again. So that that looks better. And I could even extend this. So I'm gonna check this out again from far away because this could be the right way of doing the shape. So I'm gonna go, I'm gonna climb the mountain again watch it from here and check the shape yeah that's a nice shape because it goes like a now it has that gentle curve and in the end the overhang seems like it's it's falling it's falling a little bit so that's that's the that's the effect that i wanted that's amazing that's a good that's actually a good good job for a ceiling now what we need to do is copy what we did here in the other quarters which is not always easy my god all right oh not you silly okay we made it uh 
but now that I'm up here what I need to do is to, we need to prevent mobs from spawning on the ceiling and for lack of better candles and stuff I'm just gonna use torches I'm going to try to do this symmetrically or as asymmetrically as I can but what am I what am I doing with this I think it's here and then yeah here nothing can spawn but I'm gonna put uh, one here just in case yeah that should do it and then the missing slab okay and for for the last time we go back up climb up the mountain and see it from from far away and yeah it's it's a good ceiling it looks circular it it has a nice shape to it it's not too i don't know too exaggerated the first shape was going too far up it, it it would mean it would be like the shape of a castle or something so so this is much much better it's it's in tune with the with the building i might add a stair here like but once i get the new carpenter's blocks you know if if it's if it's already you know ready for stairs i might do the the downward stairs here to to do a better easing for the windows here with the texture i mean with the with the special textures okay so that's that's amazing this that's that's a very nice short stream i think i can actually actually end the stream here and it will be like really nice so let's look at it from below from below it looks even better it's because it's uh, it's like an it's really tidy like everything connects you know the colors change i could lower down that and try to create a candelabro whatever candelabria i think you i think you call that in english i don't know my english is failing okay so here in the middle we will have the that's a nice floor actually so we will have the the smeltery and for now maybe i will keep it low profile also i don't have a lot of bricks so i don't need to to care about the chi the huge chimney once i once the chimney is done you know it's gonna occupy like pretty much all the center of the ceiling which might destroy the purpose of the curve that I just made. So I, I still need to need to see if I'm gonna, you know, actually do it or not. Uh, for some accents inside, I might do this, but it 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 collides with the window, so that's why I need the the stairs. The downward downward facing stairs oh and I'm again I'm missing one stair what is it oh here I mean it doesn't look bad but it, it goes straight against the window which is a bad thing but for now I'm gonna leave it because I think I want to change this I want to to lower the window this is at a close this is this this should be a very cozy and close uh, you know habitat because you are smeltering stuff and I don't know it should be secret or something okay that that adds a ton of lighting for now yeah that's okay so yeah with that I think we can close the stream right now so so I'm gonna do this uh, more often I was I was saying I tried to stream twice or three times a week i have a nice project coming with a friend of mine sean mccoy a co-worker from chess.com the company that i work we're gonna be streaming the classic doom in co-op something i've never done before that's, that, that's gotta be fun right 
and also I'm going to be streaming chess for chess.com also something actually you know quite fun interesting uh, wait a second how do I f1 yeah here you I have a nice screenshot fun stuff uh, chess I'm gonna be streaming some lessons because I'm horrible at chess and I wanna get better at it so I'm doing some lessons with a with a chess uh, international master or FIDE master I don't remember but we're gonna ask him if he's gonna give me some great lessons and then I'm gonna get my ass kicked on on live chess that's gonna be great and also I'm gonna continue with my other projects I, I want to keep uh, you know streaming doom uh, you know blind streaming and also the quake and stuff so that's, that's gonna be that's gonna be great so yeah so that's it for now thanks for watching I'm glad to be back this is awesome and I hope to see you pretty soon